Good afternoon, my name is Alyssa Azevedo and we're going to talk about the way music influences us. So as everyone <laughs> listens to music, how do you feel music influences our society? Uh, hi, my name is Abigail Escobar Espinoza and um, music um, influences in various ways. It has the power to influence us culturally, morally, and emotionally. Yeah, I like how you said that um, how it affects us morally because uh, when I when I get stressed, I like to listen to music before, uh, like say before a speech or something. Uh, it helps me like calm down and kind of just it's like a it's a new form of like me um, just calming down basically. Yeah. Yeah. Also, along with that, like sometimes like when you're feeling a certain way, you'll listen to songs that have lyrics that will like relate to you or your situation. It's kind of calming that someone else is like going through the same thing or like recognizes your feelings. So that's why I feel like it's yeah. like a good thing. I, I would agree with you. I know that music really reflects like your reality. And I know that based on where you come from, you kind of already like are pushed into this music that everyone else listens to around you because you can more easily relate to it than something else that really doesn't reflect who you are or what you do. Yeah, no, I know what you mean. I think that music is kind of one of the biggest factors that uh, people can use to kind of trigger their own emotions, whether that be um, kind of like more hyped up music to get ready for a game or like sad music when you're not feeling the best. And I think that that's kind of really important in order to kind of help people cope with like certain emotions. Yeah, so like uh, how recently uh, there's this rapper, his name is Meek Mill, and he talked about his experiences in, in prison and uh, celebrities around, uh, like on Twitter and stuff, they, they reacted to him and they all gave a positive like feedback and they all could relate to what he was saying. And I believe that that's like a good way to use your platform. Mm -hmm. um, so as we all agree that music has the power to make you feel a certain type of way. How do you feel that many mainstream artists have themes such as sexism, drug abuse, homophobia, materialism, um, gang violence? How do you feel like that influences people in our society and our mindsets? Yeah, well, I feel like people can like relate to that because these artists grow up with this. Like, um, they grow up experiencing uh, gun violence and kind of abuse, and that's basically what they use to talk to other people. Like, um, uh, the late Aretha Franklin, uh, she grew up during the, during the, um, civil rights, the civil rights movement, yeah, thank you. Um, and that's what she talked about, and that's what people could relate to. Yeah, aside from that, I also think that we live in this like patriarchal, patriarchal society where men think they have to be more dominant than the women to really get the respect, especially in the streets where people are about violence and about how hard they look for respect. And I don't think that really is that good of an influence for music. As a woman, like I kind of see that perspective, like in music I hear like the B word and like the degradation of women. And it's just like, that's not like how it should be or like, that's not what, like, even kids now are listening to this music, like, maybe on radio, like, clean or whatever, but kids are listening to that, and they will start to, like, act upon that, and I just think that that's not, like, good. Yeah, and what's sad is that it's, like, normalized now. Like, it's not even surprising anymore. Yeah, and just, like, kind of going back to that and the power that rap has, it's, like, if people hear these lyrics by famous rappers, they're going to think that, oh, this is how kind of, life happens like they're older than us they've gone through this so this is how it happens and when you're degrading women in lyrics then the rest of society and us as teenagers kind of believe that to be true right. oh, that's awesome do you feel like the cost of living not going so high and then parents not being able to be in the homes as much do you feel like that even leads to the um, music being more influential because yeah. those parents aren't there to create those characteristics. Yeah, so yeah, I just think that parents kind of being in the household has a big impact on the decisions they make because if they don't and they grow up kind of on themselves or on the streets, then they don't have that parental figure to look up to and they got to make everything, like all their choices on by themselves and that can tend to lead to negative decisions. Well, thank you for your um, input on how influential music is.
Yeah, it's great to talk.